pretty good day, uh, pretty good start to the weekend, I would say. Um, yeah, we pretty much, you know, uh, we were in the same place as we were during the test day yesterday. I think we we're very solid, you know, uh, straight off the box, we were good. Uh, started off P3 when I did my time, so very competitive. Um, still had definitely more in it, you know, I think the track changed a little bit compared to yesterday and I wasn't quite fully committed. So there's definitely still time there, but I was going to fully commit on the reds, which I didn't get to do the running. Um, yeah, there was a bit of a precautionary thing, I think, from Honda's side, you know, they just saw something on the data they didn't like and, you know, wanted to take their precautionary measures and, and stop me on track. So, uh, fingers crossed that we don't get an engine penalty or anything, but uh, yeah, um, I hope it will be fine. the whole weekend that the car has been fast uh, practice one we weren't able to put it together I made a mistake on my uh, my new tires in the beginning of the session we decided to do a long run um, and then, which actually ended up being my fastest lap of the session because as soon as we put the reds on uh, just a bunch of traffic out there so kind of going in blind uh, into qualifying I think everybody is in terms of the performance for the reds uh, which is not how we wanted to go into qualifying but we know the car is fast so I find it unlikely that, that we aren't gonna gonna be there for in the fight for the fast six uh, and potentially the pole. So we're gonna go in there and see what we got. Um, but high hopes at the moment. No, obviously race day here at Laguna Sega. Uh, it's been uh, been a pretty good weekend so far. I think uh, we've been the most competitive car, not one of them. Um, so obviously going into the race today, starting third, broke the lap record yesterday. Uh, pretty stoked about that, but at the same time, we want to finish the season on a high. We, we want to win this race. It's the last race of the season. It's the one race that will be remembered throughout the whole off season. So we have a pretty good chance. We need to just hit our marks, um, always check off the, the simple boxes, um, and then I think we'll, we'll be, be just fine. Uh, we have the pace in the car, car's fast, so uh, let's see if we can uh, get all our little cars up there. That'll be, that'll be awesome to, to end the season. Uh, loud and clear, young man. Radio check. Loud and clear. Christian spotter radio check. Uh, loud and clear there, John. You sound good. Not bad. You look good. Been a good season this year, my good man. Let's uh, finish up with an excellent finish. I appreciate all the work from the boys and yourself. Looking forward to, uh, Heading for the championship next year. Uh, couldn't agree anymore, Rico. It's been a been a good season with ups and downs, uh, emotional roller coaster. But everybody on the team has done a tremendous job. So uh, I'm super pleased with with what everybody's done. Um, we got our first win. We broke a track record. I don't think we we could have anticipated that going into uh, into the off season. So um, I want to thank you all. We don't beat them on track, let's beat them in the pit lane. But of course we're going to beat them in both, so 
I believe in you guys. Let's go, uh, go have some fun. This is the Firestone Grand Prix of Monterey and already several cars out of their respective columns by Colton Herder. Herder was way out wide trying to grab positions at the line as Rosenquist leads the field down into the Andretti hairpin. We've seen side by side and one oh. and two before, but there's contact. Scott McLaughlin looks like Newgarden. I see lots of cars involved. Yuri Vips. through today I think is impossible. Uh, obviously the, the start wasn't wasn't great. Um, yeah contact there had a puncture actually had suspension damage did the rest of the race with steering wheel pointing this way so so that was tough as well. Um, car wasn't quite in the same window or right hand corner so it was massively under steering compared to throughout the whole weekend and obviously the steering wheel being uh, being offset. Uh, we stayed in the game we were seventh with one lap to go. Finished sixth. Uh, got Rossi there at the end, and I think we we kept eighth in the championship because we're ahead of Herder, we're ahead of Rossi, and I was these were the people that we were fighting. So uh, obviously quite happy with that. So that was the target going into this weekend, beating them. Um, I had a, a broken mirror, so I couldn't see anything on my left side. So everybody that dived on the inside, I had no clue that they were there until they were basically there. So. Couldn't really do much for, for defending, so uh, it's, it's frustrating. Um, a lot of positives from the weekend, certainly a lot of negatives in terms of the pace we've had and, and not getting anything out of it. Um, I'm proud of this team, it's been a long season, it's been a tough season. Um, sort of a lot of bruises after this weekend, so uh, it's going to be, uh, be good with an off season.